let me tell all of us one thing what we expect is disbursement and nothing but disbursement whichever way it want to come what we expect is disbursement because today is monday hear my voice again today is monday and i know that something good is fishy good morning to my great and wonderful people of nigeria good morning to my great and wonderful ceos and all the state executives of uh, ceos i want to thank god for we all the subscribers of uh, all grants in nigeria more especially the most expectant one which is uh, uaag i want to also greet all who are making tremendous effort to see us coming to the conclusion which is disbursement no effort anybody is putting regarding to disbursement is bad or fruitless all of them are good but that is what we all are looking for but my advice this morning is to those of you who felt they are wise and wiser than everybody who are keeping us and making us to suffer continuously by delaying all we are doing by their propagandas by their letters by the everything they are doing let me tell you people one thing my wonderful people the ceos and subscribers of all these grants will no longer again be taken for granted whether you like it or not hear my voice i hear it well those who know me knows that all talks doesn't bother me but what bothers me is the action i will take later on because i am preparing myself with my team and in my preparation is not just coming on air to talk rubbish and to talk nonsense by the time you see me out with actions you will understand that we the ceos are not joking with anybody no matter who you are we are not joking with you what we are out for is to see that what we came out for is given to us what we applied for is given to us nothing more nothing less was the ones we have applied gets to us we can now go our separate ways everybody find your way if you like to cooperate with me you cooperate if you don't like to cooperate with me you go your way it is not by force we met here and it is only if i want to continue being with you i will be if i don't want to i will not be with you sometimes how we behave and do things in fact I, I, I keep getting surprised you keep having me because people of different tribes different languages will come together instead of understanding themselves what they do every day is to antagonize to give names to 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 to, to condemn to pray to fight and most of these people who we are fighting we have not seen the person one on one who we are probably have not seen this person one on one and if you happens to see this person one on one can you do it because my question can you do it one on one face to face you cannot because social media is open to you and god has given you money to buy data the what to do use that to do is to earn it and start abusing people costing people and the in fact I, it babbles me it babbles me ceos listen to me listen to me today is monday let no one distract you we are focused on disbursement nothing more nothing less we are focused on disbursement let no one distract you and distract the attention we are putting to see that god favors us with what we are looking for any other thing other than this please desist from it and do not be part of it because why i'm saying this is because i don't even care I don't even want to know the name you want to give me or the name you don't want to give me. Before now, you or who know me know me too well that I'm a man who God has raised to be to stand on his own. I've been moving. My foundation has been on ground. So you cannot come out today and say because of this or because of that. Or I'm fighting for I'm working for this or I'm working for that. That is your business and that is your cup of tea. I have grown beyond you suspecting me over what I don't even understand. I am out for the masses. All CEOs, those who have subscribed, who have spent money, let me tell you, if it is not touching you, it's touching us. 
because a lot of funds have invested. We have spent money, we have borrowed money, we have sold our properties. Some of them are used as collaterals. And now they are hunting us. Now these things are falling back on us seriously that some people don't even know they are left to their rights. They are only here task later now, and some persons are there, causing us more harm than good, causing us more pain than good. You guys should desist from it, oh. Let me tell you, you guys should desist from it. You guys should desist from it. I know I'm saying it now. I know I'm saying it now. A good fight, a good fight, deserve no evil repercussions. For the office of the All Grand Pleasure Group to that of the UAAG, let me tell you people one thing. These two bodies, in as much as I am concerned, I don't think there is issue on ground, if not for one or two individuals, maybe who felt they have issue with one person or have issue with whatever, whatever. For that reason, should not make anybody should start thinking the whole organizations are now in dispute or whatever. These people have been working in synergy, they have been working together. But if any one of them is sabotaging their effort, that person should be brought to book. That person should be brought to book. You don't know the generalizing things. It doesn't mean that in the mix of thousands there are no good ones. Or there are no good ones. There are good ones in the house. German machine do you this. Pastor Felix no do you that. Uh, 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 John do you this. This is a private person that you do you that. Let me tell you guys. Everybody should respect ourselves. Respect others too. Whether or not no human being knows it all. And nobody will tell you has not made mistake in his or her life before. If these guys have made mistake at the cost of all this pursuit, let us try to also know that they are human beings. Apostle Ken, he, 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 he doesn't do this, he doesn't do you that. He, Apostle Ken is this, he is not that. For crying out loud. For crying out loud. When you are sleeping well in your house, these people are not sleeping. When you are resting, they are not resting. And let me let you understand also that as much as you need this money, they even need it more than you. The UAAG management are on their foot 24 hours pressing buttons to see that this thing comes to, to, comes to us. What you do is to do what? To start fighting things I don't even understand you. Let me tell all of us one thing. What we expect is disbursement and nothing but disbursement. Whichever way it wants to come, what we expect is disbursement. Because today is Monday. Hear my voice again. Today is Monday. And I know that something good is fishing. Something good is coming. But if by any reason what we are looking for did not come, please expect us to do it. And when we blow, it will not be good. We are going to make sure we gather all the facts and everything. Our, our table has everything, if you don't know. Our table has all these facts and everything. They has it. And let me still say it, there is no hiding place for anybody who is part of this mess. Who is part of this delay, there is no hiding place for you, no matter who you think you are. Let us be very careful. Let us be very careful, because when we come, <laughs> when we come, we are, we are just going to send a message. A message will reach you. Simple and short. For you to know the level of preparation we the CEOs has on ground. We will only send a message to you. And in the next thing we will see you where we are. You must appear. You must come. There is no hiding place for you. So the truth is that all of you should desist from delaying this disbursement. Today is Monday and we need our disbursement. We have all subscribed. We are all tired. We suffered verification. Some beat us like we don't day. People are spending money anyhow. The place we did the verification, go to all those issues there. A plate of food is how much? People ate it every day. They spend their entire money. Transport to Abuja, borrow money to Abuja, do this, do that, load in a hotel, do this, do that. Can't we have pity and allow this thing to drop? No matter what it is, allow it to drop. 
allow it. Allow this only to drop. Let us keep our wickedness aside. Let us keep our keep keep our our our, our difference aside. Let us keep all this all this all this hatred aside and let this money drop. Let this money enter our account between today and Monday. I know why I'm saying it. Because I believe we can never meet us, this will never drop it. Because if we meet us, this will never drop. I'm calling all CEOs right now. I'm calling on all CEOs right now. All my state chairmen, get yourself ready. Get yourself ready. We the CEOs are not even waiting for only the grant. As you can see, we are preparing ourselves. We have having other means of getting money by the grace of God. Come, you see it yourself. We are not joking. Our eggs are not in two baskets. But this particular one we have subscribed, we have suffered, we have done everything. We must have it in our account. We must have it in our account. So, all my state chairmen and their executives, national executives, get yourselves ready. Get yourself, I say, ready. Get yourself ready. This week should be our last week of expectation, or our last week of expectance. This should be our last week. To God who made me and you, it should be our last week. Any other thing, you see, you take it. Enough should be called enough. We don't want to know where the money is coming from. All we know is that we want this money. And when we shall rise, you will know that we know maybe where the problems are coming from. Because they never finish this. They never finish that. It remains small. It remains small. I don't know whether we are, we are, we are, we are preparing to, to... I don't even know. I don't even know what we are preparing for that. I cannot be ready. It remains small. And the pretty is in place. If government officials want to remove trillions, they remove it without even anybody knowing. But because this has to do with the masses, it's taking a whole lot of process. A whole lot of process in the whole world is taking it. Every blessed day, another one thing or the other will come out. Please, those things that are coming out should just end now. But we are coming on air. We are coming on air. By the special grace of God, we are coming on air. We are coming on air. And by the time we come on air and talk for Mr. President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Bola Ahmed Tunubu will hear us. And other believer agencies will hear us on national televisions and news and newspapers. Then, we will understand. We will understand what is happening. We are not flying on the air. We are rooted. And we have our strong backups. You don't dare us. You don't dare us. We are the major stakeholders here. We are the major stakeholders here. We the CEOs are the major stakeholders here. You don't take us for granted. You don't dare take us for granted. I know I'm saying this because <laughs> <laughs> I'm laughing because we are coming. This week is our last week. Hoping and expecting this announcement, and I will not say it again. We are meeting all the state chairmen. We have spoken yesterday. Get yourself ready. Prepare your house. We hear from me. From today, we are expecting this announcement, and by the grace of God, I believe it will happen. By His grace, I believe. It will happen. From today, we are expecting this announcement. I don't know if it is going to be. I don't, I don't There's no date. But I believe it will meet us by surprise. By the special grace of God. It will meet us by surprise. Everybody should be focused. Don't be distracted. And don't let anything distract you. And I beg you, all the CEOs, all this hearing, this hearing, that listening to this video, listening to that video, and that will make you have, have, have attention. Please, it's not a must that every video you see you listen to. It's not by force. Don't listen to everything you hear. Don't read anything you see. People have time to start typing rubbish and start sending out any view any person they want to give without minding people who are listening to it. Because you felt that it is that the way in your mind. They just send it. You can be a leader, you will understand that before you talk to the public, you guide your words. You know you are talking to people, you are not talking to yourself. Let us be guided for God's sake. And let us know what you are doing. None of timbers and cannibals are here. Just wake up and say something. Wake up and start abusing. Wake up and start doing this. Wake up and start doing that. Maybe this is time for us to start locating these people who are bent on abusing others. You don't abuse me, you don't know, for God's sake. 
cannot cost me the loan for God's sake. If others will take it, we will not take it. We need to respect ourselves. That thing I did to other people, they do it to you, will you be happy? The answer is no, you cannot be happy. Why are you doing it to others? Why are you doing it to others? To find out the truth, not to find out the truth, you must not abuse anybody. You find out your truth. I'm not finding out your truth. You say abuse anybody. Our own is action, not abuse. We can never abuse anybody. We, the CEOs, can never abuse anybody. All we know is that we need the money we subscribe for, that grant. We need a disbursement. And when it did not come, then we take our actions. We are not taking our actions against one person or whatever. We are taking our actions against everybody who are involved. Against everybody who are involved. We are taking our actions against everybody who are involved. And other ones we have subscribed. My people are already getting the list of all of them. We are going to knock at your doors one after the other. You have not gone free. So far you have mentioned grants to God, you are going to pay it. You said that you pay it yourself to a lapel, you say to my people. If you don't do it, <laughs> I don't think there's any hiding place for you. I don't think there's any hiding place for you, no matter who you think you are. There's no hiding place for you. I will stop here for now. This is Ambassador Doctor Pascal Anyang. I say for now, bye and day. Please rest assured that we are in ex full expectant of our disbursement. Today is Monday. We have entered into it again. Please, whoever is there, we want it speedily. It has delayed too much. And this delay is causing a lot of havoc. We don't want it again. So, my people, be calm. Please don't be focused. Because I believe they want to just distract us. We will not be distracted. We are being very careful. We are watching and let's see what's going to what's going to happen. And by the time it shall blow out, the world will hear us. And then we know that our patient has has has, has, has gotten to where we not take it by force. But I don't think anybody here will take our patient again for granted. No. Enough is enough. Thank you. And you have a lovely day. May God, who have been preserving us all this while, continue to provide for us. We will not die. We shall all live to enjoy what we have worked for. But for those who have died, because so many have died, may their souls continue to rest in perfect peace. Amen. Thank you.